Hello and welcome to the weekly announcements here at Calvary United Methodist Church. Our Rise Against Hunger event, our mail packaging event is today at 1 o'clock p.m. here in the gym. This is always a fun event. We hope you'll come out and support us. Uh, come and help us package meals from 1 to 3. If you'd like to come and help with the setup, you can come at noon and we'll be here to uh, set up the event. Please wear a mask. Please remember to bring a hat with you uh, or you'll have to wear the dreaded hairnet. Um, come out and support us as we, we package these meals that will be sent all across the world and help over 33,000 people. During the month of February, during Sunday school, everyone is invited for a four-week study that's going to be held about the future of the United Methodist Church here in our Christian Life Center. Since 1972, the church has debated human sexuality and specifically the issue of the LGBTQ inclusion in our church. This series is an attempt to do four things. Number one, give our congregation a history of the conversation. Number two, help our congregation understand where things are right now in the denomination. Number three, speculate on some possible outcomes that could happen in general conference. And number four, have a conversation about ways this is going to impact us here at Calvary. Please RSVP if you plan to attend. You can do that by signing up at Masters Common, or you can go to our website at calvaryumc.com. If you want to come out and support our youth basketball teams, you can find uh, there's a schedule in from our hill each week telling you which church and what location and what time our teams are playing that particular Saturday. Calvary is also celebrating its 80th anniversary this year. And so Dave Nichols is doing a series of updates. What's happened in the last five years in the life of Calvary? And so you'll want to be paying attention the next few weeks uh, in From Our Hill as we have some interesting articles about history and about important events that have happened in the life of the church. You can now also sign up for our church retreat that's coming up at Bersheba, May 13th through 15th. I know that sounds like it's pretty far away, but it'll be here before we know it. So begin to make your plans, mark your calendars, sign up online, sign up with Pastor Eric if you'd like to go to Bershba with us this spring. If you're interested in going to Estonia this summer, please contact Jenna Mansberger by January 31st. The mission team is making plans about our summer camp, and so we want to include you if you'd like to go with us. CCF also needs your help tomorrow. We need 200 individually packaged desserts for our fifth Sunday lunch and our service day. And so if you will please bring them by the Sunday school hour, then Philip Kaufman and all of our team will pick them up and take them over to serve them as they go on Sunday morning. Super Bowl of Caring is also coming up on February 13th in conjunction with the Super Bowl. During both worship service events that morning, uh, we will have youth at all the sanctuary doors with soup pots. And uh, what they're asking you to do is just simply put money in the soup pots. Uh, this money will go to fund feeding ministries throughout the life of the church. Uh, it helps us do things like our fifth Sunday meal at Community Care Fellowship. It helps us do urban housing events in the summer. It helps us feed project transformation interns. Uh, it helps us feed room in the inn. So we invite you to give, uh, support this work, uh, important work that helps our community. In an effort to keep all of us healthy, we continue to ask that everyone wear a mask when you're in the church building. That includes small group gatherings, worship, until we can get a few more weeks through this Omicron surge. I hope you will take some time to look through From Our Hill, uh, read about all the important events coming up in the life of the church, but also take some time to look at the prayer concerns and our prayer list that's in there every week. Uh, pray for our members, our friends, our relatives, our ministry partners, and our missionaries that are serving throughout the world. I hope you will join us on Sunday for worship. We'll be here at 8, 15, 10, 30, like normal. Uh, if you can't join us in the sanctuary, we hope that you'll watch us online. Uh, you, we continue to stream both services, and you can watch us uh, anytime you'd like by simply going to the Worship Anytime button uh, on our website. You can also listen to the sermon and listen to the service by calling Sermon by Phone at 615-239-5392. Hope to see you this weekend. Pastor Eric will be preaching, and I hope to see you there. See you later. Bye.